Hey everyone, David here, and today I got another package from Glasses USA. Uh, this is gonna be my second order that I placed with them, so I wanted to talk to you a little bit about it. So, the first order I placed with Glasses USA is actually right over here. I got these pairs of glasses about a month ago now. So these are the Revel Hendry glasses, and when I went to buy these online, they gave me the option to do a buy one, get one free. So I got the sunglasses as well. And they both came in this box. They gave me some coupons and stuff. And Hillary Duff, of course. They also sent me my prescription card with my actual prescription on it. And that order was fine. I did have an issue with it though. When I placed the order, the website gives you a few different options for how fast you want to get your glasses. I went with the 7 to 10 business days, but apparently it's not you get your order in 7 to 10 business days. It's actually that Glasses USA takes 7 to 10 business days to put together your order and then they ship it out and then it's however long the shipping takes. I was left waiting for a long time. It actually took me four weeks to get both of these glasses. It was. It was a little annoying, but you know, I mean, for, for what they cost, it was okay. I ended up paying about $140 for both of these because it was buy one, get one free. My main issue with them though was that these glasses I ordered with the digital block lenses and those are supposed to block out the blue light. So it's a blue light filter basically, the blue light that you get from your electronic devices like uh, your cell phone or your TV or anything like that. I ordered these to have the blue light filter and they didn't come with it. As you can tell, the reflection, it's green. It's the anti-glare. And these over here, pretty sure you can see, they're reflecting like a bluish, maybe purple light because these actually have the blue light filter. These don't have it, these do. So I was really disappointed with that. And to talk a little bit more about that, I actually went online onto the Glasses USA website when I got these in the mail. And I was chatting with uh, a lady online that was kind of upset because I could have saved $40 if I hadn't paid for that. So my order would have been 100 bucks for both of them. And when I talked to the lady, she was telling me that the only thing I could do was just send them back in to get them exchanged for the correct ones or I could send them back in for a refund, a partial refund or a full refund. If I were to send them back in for a partial refund, I'd only get a refund for these glasses. And since I used a buy one, get one coupon, they were only gonna give me back $10, which I thought was pretty lame. If I sent them back in for a full refund, then I would have to send both pairs back, both of these and the sunglasses. And the problem with that is that since it took me, it took four weeks for me to get these pairs of glasses and I didn't want to wait another four weeks just to get my refund back because I was getting used to my new prescription. I mean, these glasses that I've had uh, for a while now, I've had them for two years and this, this is an old prescription and this is my new one that I was supposed to get earlier this year and I'm barely getting around to it now. So I didn't want to send them back in. The last option was to just send these back in and get them exchanged for ones that have the blue light filter. But again, it was gonna take like another two weeks to get there and another four weeks to get new ones. And I didn't want to wait. I didn't want to wait another month and a half. So I just decided to keep these. And I mean, they're fine. You know, I like the color of the frames. They're pretty different from anything I've ever owned. They actually work pretty well. I mean, they are my prescription. My main concern was that the prescription would be wrong ordering from an online website, but I was actually pretty surprised that these were the right lenses. A way of working around that blue light filter is that I found a setting on my phone where I can change the warmth of the screen. I'm pretty sure all smartphones do it now where you can just make it a little warmer and it'll emit less blue light. And on my computer monitors, there's also a setting on, on there where I could change the uh, warmth of it. So I just did that instead and I decided to just deal with it and keep these glasses because I wasn't sure if I could trust Glasses USA again. And then 
after wearing these for a while, I noticed that they don't really go with a lot of colors that I have of my clothes. So I decided to order another pair of glasses and I went with a different brand because these frames that I have and these over here are the Revel brand that I think are made by Glasses USA because they're, they're not a name brand. And I decided to go with, uh, I guess, a sort of a name brand. I don't consider them a name brand. I mean, I guess they're well known or better known than others, but I decided to try these out because they were relatively inexpensive and I'll get to that in a little bit as to why they're less expensive than if you went to your own optical. I got some Emporio Armani glasses, some frames, and I'll go ahead and just open these up for you guys and show you what it looks like. They come in a bag and it just says, see, see what's inside, Glasses USA. I really wish they would add some more padding on the inside of it because I would really hate to get some broken frames right now because I have been waiting for these for three weeks. Uh, so, inside the bag, there's nothing else inside. You just get this box pretty similar to this one. It says, happy to see you. I hear something shaking, I hope it's not broken. Okay, now, so you get your prescription card and you also get, I don't know, something to post on Instagram. I had posted on Instagram and kind of told them about my issues and didn't get a response, which was unfortunate, but oh well. And these are the glasses. There's some white stuff on it. I don't know what that is. But anyways, I've, I've purchased some uh, Armani glasses like this before and they came in the same case. So I think it's really cool that for what Glasses USA considers a premium brand, they send you one of these cases instead of the hard cases from Glasses USA. I mean, I would have preferred a hard case, but it's kind of cool that you get the one from the, the brand of the glasses. So, these are the glasses. Comes with a microfiber cloth and a little booklet from Emporio Armani. It's a certificate of authenticity, but it's in another language. I don't know if that's Italian. I speak Spanish and that doesn't look like Spanish. Obviously, it probably is Italian. So yeah, there's just a little warranty booklet and stuff on the glasses. And now I'm just gonna take out the glasses from this plastic and try them on. I really hope that they are the right prescription and there's nothing wrong with them. Um, I'll show you guys first the glasses. So they're a shiny black. I can't tell if that's a scratch or not. I immediately saw something on the windows and I'm hoping it's not a scratch. Well, it looks like it was just a little, a little fiber. Although it kind of looks like a scratch. I don't know. It's not really coming off. I'll have to look at it under a light. So, anyways, these are the lenses, the glasses. Um, they do look like they have the anti-reflective coating because it's not reflecting any white light. So let me just make sure that the prescription's good. And so far so good, I can see. So this is pretty cool. Um, yeah, they feel pretty good, they're snug. Um, yeah, they, they're nice, I like them so far. I like that now I have something different than just this teal to wear and I just wanted to sorry just kind of get used to them yeah they definitely fit better than these that's for sure so if you want to order some glasses like this the website is glassesusa.com 
pretty sure you've heard about them. They've been pretty much everywhere. And if you're on Instagram, don't be surprised if it pops up later in your feed just because you're always listening. But I mean, Glasses USA was pretty cool in the way that you order because you get to see a ton of frames and they have their premium brands, which are considered like Ray-Ban, Oakley, Prada, Gucci, um, Armani, like these. And then they have their other brands that they make themselves, like the Revel Hendry. And I know the, the Hilary Duff line is pretty popular too. I think it's called Muse and Hilary Duff. And then there's also a Muse without Hilary Duff. So if you're interested, the, the website, glassesusa.com, it's pretty simple to follow through. You just pick out your frames that you want, and then you could even take a picture of yourself and try them on in the in the website like it'll actually put the picture of the the frames on your face so you can see if the shape fits your face pretty nicely or not one thing that i found really helpful was that on the inside of your frame if you have a frame already i don't know if you can see that there should be some numbers right here um let me see this one because this is a darker color if you have frames already, if you have glasses, you can look in here. I hope I'm getting that in the camera. There's some numbers here, like it'll be like a 50 something and then a, a number between like 15 and 20 or something like that. And those basically tell you the sizes of the lens and then the size of the, uh, uh, I'm forgetting the word, like the temple, the side of the glasses and it'll tell you the, the width of the nose piece right here. So if you're on their website and you're looking at a frame, like usually right underneath the picture of the frame, it tells you the numbers of the, the dimensions of it. So what you can do is get your own frames and it'll say like uh, 50, like this is a 54, 17, which means that the lenses are 54 millimeters and 17 millimeters is right here the nose piece and then it should have another number that's like in the hundreds and that's actually the length of this part of the frame so if you have some glasses already you can actually compare the numbers and see how similar in size the ones that are on glassesusa.com are and it's really cool i mean they provide a diagram and everything in the product description of the frames that you're looking at just so you can make sure that you're picking something that's pretty similar in size. And the, the thing that I found out was I saw quite a bit of frames on the Glasses USA website and I purposely called my optometrist slash optical to see if maybe they could get them ordered. And the models that I asked my optician to look up for me were actually discontinued. So this frame, is actually discontinued now so you won't be able to find it like if you go to your optical in town and I think that's where Glasses USA is able to provide better discounts because Armani doesn't make this frame anymore so Glasses USA gets it at a discounted price I think that's how it works I'm not quite sure I don't work for them but I mean, either way, I thought it was pretty cool because I don't have any vision insurance this year and I'm not sure if I'm gonna get it next year. It actually seems like ordering glasses online is a lot cheaper. The only thing that stinks is the weight and I haven't ordered glasses with the expedited shipping. I may try that at some point because it, I think it's only like $10 or $20 depending on how fast you want them. But I'm, I'm a little worried about doing that because I'm afraid that they won't actually ship in time and I would pay another extra amount of money for a service I didn't get from them. And on these glasses, I did not get the blue light filter because I was afraid that they wouldn't put, put it on the lenses again. So I'll just stick with these and see how they do. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, leave a like. If you have any questions or anything about uh, glasses USA or need any help with them, just leave a comment down below. See you guys later. Bye.